From iconic collaborations with athletic legends to groundbreaking innovations that elevate performance and style, Adidas has long been synonymous with success. Yet, in this fast-paced world of ever-changing trends and cutthroat competition, even the mightiest can stumble. From shifting consumer preferences and aggressive competition to strategic missteps and market saturation, each sign unravels a compelling narrative of challenges Adidas must confront to secure its position. Can Adidas rise above these hurdles and regain its dominance, or are we witnessing the beginning of an astonishing downfall that will send shockwaves through the fashion world? But first, let's ask ourselves, what makes Adidas an enduring symbol of athletic prowess and style? From legendary collaborations with sports icons to pioneering technologies that push the boundaries of performance, Adidas has long been a powerhouse in the industry. However, the game is changing rapidly, and even giants can fall if they fail to adapt. From the severed ties with Kanye West's Yeezy brand to the challenges posed by the Chinese market and underwhelming sales of the flagship partnership with Beyonce, the once-dominant athletic apparel brand must confront numerous obstacles to regain its footing. In a shocking turn of events, Adidas decided to sever ties with Kanye West's Yeezy brand due to a series of highly controversial remarks made by the rapper and fashion designer. This decision came at a considerable price, as Adidas incurred significant losses and anticipated a severe blow to revenues due to the remaining stock of unsold Yeezy footwear. This abrupt termination serves as a harbinger of the challenges to come for Adidas in 2023. Adidas's fourth quarter financial report revealed distressing figures, with an operating loss of a staggering 724 million euros, 763 million dollars, and a net loss from continuing operations amounting to 482 million euros. The company faced a decline in currency neutral revenues by 1% primarily attributed to the termination of the Yeezy partnership. These alarming figures foreshadow the dire situation Adidas finds itself in and set the stage for an arduous path to recovery. Adidas finds itself facing a daunting future with an anticipated operating loss of 700 million euros in 2023. This projection represents a major turning point for the company, as it would be the first annual loss in over 30 years. The staggering figures include write-offs totaling 500 million euros for potential Yeezy inventory, along with an additional 200 million euros in one-off costs. These numbers paint a grim picture of the obstacles ahead and cast doubt on the brand's long-term sustainability. The projected operating loss serves as a wake-up call for Adidas, forcing the company to reassess its strategies and make difficult decisions. It highlights the need for a comprehensive review of the business model and a shift in focus towards profitability and efficiency. Adidas must navigate through the challenges posed by the terminated Yeezy partnership, ensuring the remaining stock of unsold footwear is managed effectively to minimize losses. To combat these financial setbacks, Adidas must undertake a thorough evaluation of its operations, identifying areas for cost reduction and streamlining processes. The company needs to explore innovative approaches to inventory management, supply chain optimization, and product development to regain its competitive edge. Furthermore, the projected loss raises concerns about the long-term viability of the brand. Adidas must prove its resilience and ability to adapt to changing market dynamics to regain investor confidence. Clear communication of the company's strategic direction, accompanied by tangible actions, will be crucial in rebuilding trust and demonstrating a path to recovery. While the projected loss is undoubtedly a significant challenge, it also presents an opportunity for Adidas to reevaluate and realign its priorities by focusing on core strengths, enhancing consumer engagement and investing in research and development, the brand can redefine itself and emerge stronger from this setback. Adidas's new CEO, Bjorn Gulden, steps into a challenging role as he takes over the reins from Kasper Rorsted. Gulden acknowledges 2023 as a transitional year, emphasizing the need to reduce inventories, curtail discounts, and re-establish profitability by 2024. The company's renewed focus on its core pillars, product consumers, retail partners, and athletes, aims to reignite Adidas's unique business model by striking a balance between global direction and local needs, embracing agility, and investing in sports and culture. 
Golden envisions a revival of the brand's credibility and brand heat. Amid Beijing's stringent COVID measures, Adidas faces considerable challenges in the Chinese market. The company experienced a sharp decline in sales in 2022, adding further strain to its already burdened financials. As one of many international companies affected by China's strict regulations, Adidas must navigate these tumultuous waters to regain its footing in one of the world's largest consumer markets. While Adidas has enjoyed fruitful partnerships with numerous celebrities, its flagship collaboration with global icon Beyoncé has fallen short of expectations. The lackluster performance of this highly anticipated venture has further compounded the company's woes. Adidas must confront the reality of dwindling sales in this particular segment and strategize accordingly to regain its competitive edge. In the aftermath of the Ukraine invasion, Adidas joined the ranks of international companies that departed from the Russian market. The decision to close physical stores and cease online operations in Russia reflects the challenges faced by the brand in navigating geopolitical uncertainties. This retreat from a once promising market adds to the mounting pressures and necessitates a re-evaluation of Adidas' global expansion strategies. Adidas has suffered significant setbacks due to inventory write-offs and increased supply chain costs in a post-pandemic world. The need to manage unsold Yeezy stock has resulted in considerable losses, while the macroeconomic backdrop has weakened consumer demand, prompting the brand to resort to heavy discounting. Successfully addressing these challenges will require innovative approaches to optimize inventory management and streamline supply chain operations. Investor confidence in Adidas has wavered in the face of mounting challenges. The company's stock witnessed a decline of 1.7% during morning trade in Europe, highlighting concerns about its future prospects. Despite this setback, Adidas maintains a year-to-date increase of over 11% indicative of investors' mixed sentiments. The delicate balance between optimism and caution underscores the criticality of the brand's actions in the coming months. Amidst these turbulent times, Adidas must chart a definitive path to recovery by implementing strategic measures such as inventory optimization, cost control, and renewed emphasis on product innovation and consumer engagement the brand can rebuild its reputation and reclaim its market position. Drawing upon the strength of its rich heritage, Adidas has the potential to overcome these obstacles, emerge stronger, and forge a new era of success. As Adidas faces an unprecedented crisis, its ability to adapt and execute effective strategies will determine its fate in the coming years. The signs of trouble are clear with financial losses, terminated partnerships, and challenging markets. However, the spirit of resilience and the core values that have defined Adidas throughout its history provide a glimmer of hope. By confronting the issues head-on, leveraging its strengths, and embracing innovation, Adidas can navigate this storm and rise to new heights. The journey ahead will be arduous, but with the right leadership, a renewed focus, and an unwavering commitment to its consumers, Adidas can rewrite its narrative and emerge stronger than ever before.